Physically, it's a full body workout. boat and you're with your friends and just having fun out on the water and instead of running back and forth somewhere you're sticking together the whole time um well when I started I had absolutely no physical background so the fact that now I can actually run six kilometers without stopping um, and still have time to do more it pushes you to limits you never even knew you had in the beginning the fact that you get up and do more in your day before 7 a.m. than most people do throughout their whole day. At the end of the day, it's all about it is hard. Who wants it more? Just when you're feeling pain in your legs, you start feeling it in your arms, and then you just everything's telling you to quit, and your body just keeps going. So uh, I've played many sports and done everything, but. Nothing like that. Physically, it's, I mean, your whole body's hurting after. Throwing its lungs and, and legs and arms and back, it's everything. For the coxies, it's more for the mental, not the physical. So instead of having to physically have the endurance, we have to be able to plan every movement down the course. And then on a split second, just change the entire thing. In many respects, it's the ultimate team sport. Um, every athlete has to be consistent with the other athletes in their crew. Um, you have to be able to row with people, train with people, um, compete with them on a daily basis. You could have the strongest guys in the boat, the best athletes, but if they don't work together, they will ultimately fail. This year, um, the big thing that we've tried to change is adding in one more school. So we've added in Ancaster High School, so now we have five high schools rowing. And the other uh, big change we've made this year is to make sure everybody has qualifications. So we've added in some coaching education courses. The plan is over the next five years is to start implementing, actually all the coaches have to have um, first aid requirements, have to have qualifications in some kind of coach education, have to keep those up to date. Uh, and so it's focusing on the quality of the coaching for not just the schools, but for every other program within Leander Boat Club. You can come and you can start rowing uh, anytime you want and it's, uh, you, or it's really, uh, the coaches really focus on uh, your progression and how well you get so you can start off with no athletic background at all and you can be a stellar rower by the end of the season. It's a lot of hard work but there's a lot of rewards to it. It means everything. I mean it's uh, all aspects of your life really it affects. It's too hard to not be passionate about it. Your boat becomes your family. I mean, yeah. You're Everybody down here becomes your family. You don't even have to know what it is to row. You don't have to be big. You just have to have fun. You can be small, large, big, or tall, or anything. I don't know. It's such a fulfilling sport. You just feel so good coming off the water. It's, uh, the, the kids here in the high school program love it. It's a great, what a great way to start your day. I don't know if you could sum up rowing in one word. I don't think it's possible, actually. Wow. Commitment. Commitment. Interesting. Uh, you show great discipline. Amazing. Different. Yep. Commitment. Okay. Family. Family. Oh my gosh. Friends. Family. Friends. Crew and friends. Dedication. Passion. Life. It's life. It's what it is. It's everything. It's joy. It's pain. It's sorrow. It's ecstasy. It's disappointment. It's anger. It's everything. 
Teamwork, for sure.